Last week on Collaboration Star, we met finalists from the Mid-South, East, and West Coast regions. This week, your online votes will send two from the Mid-South to the grand finale in Los Angeles, where one will be named Collaboration Star. The person who will represent all of Collaboration at the end that Asian Music Awards in Hong Kong. I would like you to give a big round of applause to Then collaboration star. My name is Katie and I'm representing Atlanta and hopefully representing the Mid-South region at the collaboration finale in LA. Um, a lot of pieces I do are really deep and dark and emotional but I hope that, that I can start um, doing pieces that are um, funny and at the same time have content. Okay, well, but so what no cable? Because I can live with no regrets and forget the only thing left stable. When will it get here, and here, and there? Mom, I never cared. I wondered where you found numbers to multiply because I was mesmerized by the seeds in my mind. Um, I think that you should vote for me because I have the talent and the passion that it takes. Hi guys, my name is Chun Sung An, and I am the winner of Collaboration Chicago. As some of you may know, I am a YouTube musician uploading violin covers on my channel. It all started with about like 10 views. All of a sudden I started getting a lot of views from people all around the world. A couple of my friends just told me, oh you should give Collaboration Chicago a try. It's like a lot of fun. And it turned out to be a great event. I think I deserve to go to LA because I believe that my music is something the world needs to hear. Hey guys, this is Heaven and I play the keyboard for sticks. First of all, I want to thank the Collaboration Dallas team and staff. It was hard to believe that we won the competition in Dallas. I've been able to find myself through music and sticks. No matter what happens, this has been a good, great experience. My name is Mylan Grace Ramos, a.k.a. your girl R.A.M., and I am representing Collaboration Houston for Collaboration Star 2012. I believe that my music is for everybody. If I get a chance to go to Los Angeles with some of the best musicians and artists from this enti the entire nation, if I get that chance, originality is still alive. Hey, yo, DJ, throw that track on there. Ah, ah, I guess it started. 
happened, the lights went out, and everybody started running. Someone's trying to figure it out. I can feel it. Quenched in my ribs, I felt freezing as my cold air blew out. Dance through the evening, paranormal. Slowly beating calls of the dream, but the ghost gathered that in itself, the devil, the dreams I observed. Veils from the other side of the curb, hold the concrete, don't pad. Scribble down my words in the line like, this is what it's like to bleed. And you put your fingers in it, paint me a picture of what you think. Make it beautiful, or make it look like love. Make it hang from the heavens, make it break my trust. Make it real, make it dangerous. <laughs> One. When it comes to musicians, there's always more than meets the eye. Now I'm going to show you what a typical day of mine looks like. As you can see, Hani is not with us. Uh, she had to go back to Korea for a uh, visa issue. Help us to get LA and finish it for her. Yeah, I hope you enjoy your day with me. Yeah. One thing that I always have to do before I leave is check the weather. Just to make sure that I can take my bike, um, or if not, then I would take the bus. But um, it looks good today, so we can take the bike. Okay, so one thing that I have to do every morning before I go to school or work is call my family. I just basically asked them about how their day was yesterday and I told them what I'm going to do today. So today, I'm going to call my mom. Hopefully she's up. It was here. Hello. Uh, uh. How are you doing? Um. Um. I'm recording the Mnet TV show thingy. Mm. Today I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go to NBC Academy again. I have a lesson today, so yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna be making music today. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll call back tomorrow. Bye bye. Bye. <laughs> Alrighty, I'm just about to leave my house, and boom, there she is, just your average 2006 Ford Explorer with them custom 32 inch rims. Alright, we are now officially inside the Gucci Mobile. I call my car the Gucci Mobile, just FYI. For driving purposes, jamming out to, you know, in the car while riding out. Anthony Ranieri's solo EP called New Cathedral, okay? So, oh, hi guys. <laughs> so. Sandra, I need an answer. I need you to be honest with the boy who lives by honesty in <laughs> So I listen to music too when I ride, and um, my favorite album is Childish Gambino's uh, Cul de Sac. Hear that? Yeah. And then, and then I get yeah. Hello, I'm here to teach my student a guitar lesson today. Her name is Yeji. Abraham is just so talented. Yes, She's yes. Such an amazing teacher. Man, I know. Indescribable. 
이름이 뭐예요? 은이랑 아린이랑 선생님이랑. So this is the Lakeville at Northwestern University. You can see like rocks all around the entire little island. You can also see the skyline for Chicago right there. And for me, I just like to come here and um, just like think to myself like. Honestly, if you were watching like the lake, like this view is amazing. The scenery is like. Yeah. You have chunky eyes. Chopsticks. Ego. Karate Kid. I thought I was all of it. That's all that they would call me. So I thought that was all of me. <laughs> spot to just chill do my music making and just relax uh, any ideas song titles um, lyrics that I made up in my head during you know the course of the day and I just write them down uh, I usually start off like my jam sessions just by uh, not even picking up an instrument at all first to start off I usually grab one of my um, song journals and as you can see I write a lot and there's a lot more uh, journals scattered throughout the house and yeah I sit on my bed and I write for an hour hour and a half um, so I come here every single day to practice and I get lessons here um, two to three times a week and here are like practice rooms everywhere here are some more practice rooms here's like some music studio places where like recording happens more practice rooms live studio here's another studio here's like a lounge it's where I do all my extra work um, yeah. so here's my teacher <laughs> hello <Hi. laughs> And this is where I do most of my work. We are at Crystal Church right now. We stay here till like... I don't know, it depends on the days and practices, but we are here till like 1 a.m. or midnight, so. side of bacon all the boys love me girls just keep hating i'm like water baby don't got no expiration so good at this rhyme and game got no asphyxiation Shin. asphyxiation what I always do. I strive to be like mama, prepared to fill her shoes, and to my family is where I stay true. Shout out to my other fam, the Gucci crew. I'm here at an open mic in downtown Athens. Um, I come here uh, the first Wednesday of every month to sometimes with my old and new pieces. They're just really welcoming here. And um, yeah, I'm just a local, so it's, it's really 
fun. And mom, get away with that eyeglass. No, I wanted contacts. Stop talking about my eyesight. Can we talk about this boring brown hair? Can I please get highlights? And no, mom, I don't care to watch another Paris by night. You can disapprove all you want, but I'm an American, mom. I can exercise my rights. So right quick, I want to introduce you guys to two significant people in my life. Obviously, they are my parents, my mom, and my dad. They're my inspiration because practically I think of them as the epitome of the American dream. So that's that. Mom, do you have anything to say? You want to tell? Hi, this is my daughter and we are very proud of her. We support her 100%. Uh, she'll get there with the love and support that we have, both dad and me. How are you, Daddy? You have anything to say? Yeah, I love you. So it is exactly 12 o'clock now, um, and it's time for us to start our midnight rendezvous. So it's 12, midnight. It is currently midnight, and I'm using my watch because right now, well, my phone's dead. So what do you know, right? Hi, it's time for a midnight rendezvous. What is the biggest lesson that I learned? What is your biggest lesson? Money is important, but don't let it take over. To never procrastinate. Don't be afraid to take chances. Biggest lesson are... Thrive in rich simplicity. I mean, I still do procrastinate. Uh, fortunately, I was raised to not be afraid of um, taking chances. This idea of just being happy. Um, no matter how much money you have. I think it's really important to always keep a set schedule. Because that happiness will shine through and that can make other people happy. I guess the biggest worry that I have right now in present day is just making it in terms of finding my spot. And I think the biggest worry right now for me is I, the biggest worry for me now is just making sure that those who are following me uh, on my journey, are they going to be just as happy and content as I am? Um, finding a job, you know, getting that career that I want. So that's that. Like, I'm not sure if I'll be able to manage my time well in school because school starts in like a week or two. Um, and that's, that's my biggest joy right now, just being able to come full circle with myself as a person, with my self-confidence. I never expected it to come this far. Um, what is my dream? <laughs> my dream is... My dream is... To be able to inspire others. I bring myself on to the highest platform possible. I think that my spoken word can move people. It can tell what other people are can't put into words or they're too afraid to say. Music is like a universal language. And just like any other language in the world, it makes communication possible. Music really finds its value and its true meaning when you share it with others. Sometimes people couldn't understand what we're saying but people could understand our music. So music helped us to change our lives. And we believe that music can change the world. Yeah. The world. This is what it's like to bleed in. Put your fingers in it. Take me a picture of what you think. Make it beautiful. I love being different. You know, I got made fun of a lot as a kid. 
being different enables me to just be comfortable in my skin. I'm not going to med school after this. No, it's not that I didn't get in. Um, I think that you should vote for me because I have the talent and the passion that it takes to not only tell a story, but um, hopefully to motivate and to inspire young people. I wondered where you found numbers to multiply because I was never writing a seeds in my mind of red trees and I think I deserve to go to LA because my music is something I like to share more than enjoy and I believe that my music is something the world needs to hear. Just to have the opportunity to be on a platform to present my message to everybody who's been, you know, made fun of, who's been, you know, put down in any kind of way. And if you've ever seen me perform or would hope to love to see me perform, you know, hint, hint, nudge, nudge, Los Angeles. We get to go to LA, there might be a chance that Honey might come play with us. So, please, please, vote for sticks. Yes, <laughs> vote for us.